Are you tired of your run command not saving the history? Having to type the command in full every single time can be quite inconvenient, especially for those who frequently use the run dialog. But don't worry, in this video, we have got you covered with some fixes that will help you resolve the issues of your run command not saving its history. Check your privacy settings. Here's a common reason why Windows might be neglecting to save your run command history. It's possible that you previously blocked the tracking of your app launches. Let's address that. Click on the Start menu and open up the settings. Look for the Privacy and Security option in the left sidebar and click on it. Within the Windows Permission section, locate and click on General. Now keep an eye out of a toggle switch that says let Windows improve start and search results by tracking app launches. Make sure to enable that toggle switch. Once you have completed these steps, give it a whirl. Try running a few commands via the run dialog box and see if it's now saving your command history and providing autocomplete suggestions. If for any reasons you find that this option is grayed out and still not working, fret not, we have got another fix for you. Edit registry history is the let windows improve start and search results by tracking app launches option grayed out on your pc no worries we have got a handy solution using the registry editor to help you get windows to save your run command history click on the start menu and simply search for registry editor once you spot it go ahead and click on it a user account control that's a uac pop-up may appear just click on yes to proceed before making any changes to the registry, it's always a good idea to take a backup. The registry contains crucial elements for your Windows PC and any mistake could potentially lead to serious issues. To take a backup, click on the file menu and select export. Save the registry backup to a safe location. Now let's navigate through the registry. Go to current user, then software, Microsoft, Windows, Current Version, Explorer and then finally select Advanced. On the right hand side, keep an eye out for Start Track Progs. If you can't find it, simply right click in this area, select New and then choose D Word Value. Rename the new entry as Start Underscore Track Progs. Double click on the Start Track Progs entry to open it. In the value data field, enter 1 and then click OK to save the changes. Close the registry editor and restart your PC. This will now allow the registry changes to take effect. Once your PC has restarted, check if the run dialog box is now saving your history. Try some common fixes. If the previous fixes didn't do the trick, don't worry. There are a few more common fixes you can try to give your run command history back on track. Let's check them out. First and foremost, let's start with a classic troubleshooting step, restart your PC. Sometimes a simple restart can resolve temporary glitches and issues on your Windows PC. So give it a try. Restarting might just do the trick and help you restore the functionality of the run dialog. If a restart doesn't do the trick, we can move on to the next fix. Try running the system file checker tool. This nifty tool scans your system files for any errors or inconsistencies and automatically repairs them. Click on the Start menu and search for Command Prompt. Once you find it, open it up. In the Command Prompt window, type SFC forward slash scan now and hit enter. Sit back and let the tool scan your system files. Once the scan completes, close the Command Prompt and restart your PC. This will allow any repairs to take effect. Now, if you are still facing issues, it's a good idea to scan your PC for malware. Here's how you can do it using the Windows Security. Click on the Start menu and search for Windows Security. Open it up. In the Windows Security windows, click on Virus and Threat Protection. Under the Scan option, select Microsoft Defender Antivirus Offline Scan. Click on Scan Now and start the malware scan. Your PC will restart and scan will begin. By scanning your PC for malware, 
you can ensure that no malicious software is interfering with the proper functioning of the run dialog. Give these fixes a try and hopefully one of them will help you resolve the issue and get your run command history back on track. That's it for this video. If you have any questions or suggestions, drop them below and share this useful video with your friends and family. Like the video and subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to press the bell button to receive alerts for videos on Windows tips and tricks.